Good morning, everyone. I'm Sara Mizer Formentin, and um, I'm presenting a contribution we developed with Barbara Zanuttig, Professor Barbara Zanuttig from the University of Bologna. Um, we are here presenting a new reduction factor, gamma. Uh, uh, we developed accounting for, to account for the reducing effect on the wave overtopping discharge of uh, uh, crown walls and parapets on top, on top of smooth dikes. Uh, the, um, the aim of the contribution is uh, to present uh, uh, a literature review of the other methods uh, available for uh, uh, the representation of such effects and their limits uh, and so present such new formula we developed based on uh, machine learning technique, which is the genetic programming. And at the end of the presentation, we will see also the extension of uh, this new formula to uh, um, rubble mount structures with uh, uh, crown walls. So the outline uh, had uh, I've already explained it. It will go through the analysis of literature of the formula available and the presentation of uh, the new method we developed, discussing and presenting the, the uh, advantages of the genetic programming technique we adopted. And we will see the application, uh, the results of such new formula and the extension of the formula to the other type of structures. Uh, the, the, the state of the art, uh, the literature starts with the uh, experimental campaign uh, conducted by Van der Sleutel in 2015 in the laboratory of the University of Ghent. This is the first systematic analysis of the effects uh, of prominence, uh, crown walls and or parapet on the wave overtopping discharge. They uh, analyze the different uh, structure configuration, different combination of such elements uh, under non-breaking waves exclusively. And they prompt a new uh, gamma star coefficient accounting for the such reducing effect to be included in uh, um, in the Eurotop 2007 formula for the representation of the wave overtopping discharge at non-breaking waves. Such formula is characterized by the uh, coefficient 1 at the exponential and uh, uh, their work consists in the, a formulation, a series of formulation of gamma star to represent the effects of the wall height through the parameter H wall, the wall height uh, divided by the total freeboard RC, the effects of the berm or promenade through B, the, the promenade length uh, to the wavelength L, lambda, which is the ratio between the parapet height and the wall height HW, and epsilon, which is the inclination of the, the angle of the inclination of the parapet. As I said, they prompted a series of different formulation for gamma star according to the different combination of structural elements. So we have a formula for gamma star in case of just a wall on top of the dike, a wall with parapet, a, uh, a berm or prominent, a berm with wall, berm, wall and parapet. So different formulation for each different situation. And um, the slide shows the optimal agreement uh, between the experiments by Van Dorsler and uh, um, the Eurotop 2007 formula showing the in the ordinate the dimensionless overtopping discharge against in the abscissa the relative freeboard including the gamma star coefficient. Uh, in 2018, um, the Eurotop manual uh, directly applied the coefficient by gamma, gamma star by Van der Sleutel 2015, which was sold for Eurotop 2007, to the new formula for Q by Van der Meer and Bruce, adopted in the updated version of the manual. And essentially, such formula differs for the 1.3 exponent of the um, uh, exponential term. 
The following Euro Top 2019, Professor Zanotting and me uh, conducted a series of laboratory and numerical tests at the University of Bologna, aiming at extending uh, the, the, the casistic, uh, the, the test already conducted by Van Dorsler, especially to breaking waves. We can see here indeed that uh, we tested also breaking wave condition with lower values of C with respect to the original experiment by Van Dorsler, different uh, slopes um, and shorter berm widths. So instead of a long promenade, we focused on berm of the smaller lengths. And we aimed at extending the uh, gamma star coefficient by uh, Van Dorsler to uh, breaking waves also. And we developed the gamma star star uh, coefficient, uh, we can see here, uh, which is, uh, consists in the gamma star coefficient divided by the tan h of uh, uh, xi. Uh, we see that when xi uh, increases, uh, namely increases up, uh, great, becomes greater than two, gamma stars uh, goes, uh, the denominator goes to one, and so gamma star coincides to gamma star star. So the main difference is just for breaking waves. And we directly included this new coefficient in the Eurotop 2018 formula for both breaking and non-breaking waves. But uh, during the analysis, we observed that the Eurotop formula uh, with the original gamma star coefficient provides uh, an underestimation bias of all the Van Dorsler data and our new data we see here in uh, circles, green and yellow, mm, with and without parapet. This is the, uh, the chart uh, proposing the overtopping discharge against uh, the relative free board with gamma star. And so our new formula for breaking and non-breaking waves uh, propose the same underestimation bias. Uh, uh, here we can see uh, the overtopping discharge against uh, the relative free board with just our new data, but the result is the same for the data by Van Dorsen. In both cases, uh, breaking and non-breaking waves, we have an underestimation bias of all the data. Starting from uh, this constatation, uh, and aiming at providing uh, maybe an easier representation of all the different structural elements, different gamma star, uh, which may be uh, used straightforward independently of the, uh, on the combination of the structural element. We uh, adopted the genetic programming technique, uh, which is a machine learning tool to develop a new formula um, the formula, the, the training of the genetic programming was uh, made on all these structures uh, configuration, which consists in the, um, the union of the data by Van Dorsen and our new condition, uh, all referring to uh, smooth structures. And the result is such formula we uh, named gam for gamma star GP. The main difference of the genetic programming with respect to uh, the neural network is that genetic programming develops a formula and not a black box, a formula including elements we can see and check and maybe correct. And uh, the gamma star coefficient, the gamma star GP, is supposed to be included in the Eurotop 2018 formula. And it includes uh, several elements, each of one accounts for a different contribution. Contribution for the wave breaking, the contribution for the berm or prominent, the contribution of the wave height, uh, the wall height, and of the sloping parapet. And we see that uh, each of these contribution directly goes to zero when this special element is not included. So this means that uh, such formula can be directly applied to each structure combination independently of the presence or, mm, or less or no of uh, the berm, the wall, etc. Uh, the results of the application of the genetic programming uh, technique are here shown in these two charts for breaking and non-breaking waves to the left and to the right. We see the overtopping discharge against the relative freeboard again. 
to the right we see the non-breaking waves all the data by Van Dorsen our new data with triangles uh, red and yellow we see the optimal agreement and the non-biased distribution around the, uh, this, uh, the around the formula and the same is found for uh, breaking waves where we see here we can see our data the triangles compared to other data from the literature on breaking waves uh, due to the uh, following the promising results, the good performance of uh, such a um, coefficient, we uh, finally aimed at extending it to structures characterized by gamma f lower than one, so rubble mound, breakwaters with top crown walls, and vertical walls with parapet. To this purpose, we uh, uh, we selected a number of data sets from the Eurotop database on wave overtopping, uh, including these uh, structure types, and we directly applied our new uh, coefficient in the Eurotop formula for the prediction of Q. And we see in uh, this uh, slide the comparison between predicted in the ordinate and uh, measured values of Q for all the different data sets. And the performance achieved is the same uh, is similar with the, the performance we obtain for smooth structures only. So uh, we have uh, seen uh, the, um, we have a, a, an excursus of the literature methods available for uh, the parameterization of the reducing effects of, on Q of uh, crown walls, berm and parapets on top of smooth structures. We have seen the main limits and we have seen the new formula we developed based on genetic programming. It may contemporarily account for both breaking and non-breaking waves. It is characterized by, characterized by the same accuracy of the other existing methods, but solves the underestimation bias of Eurotop 2018 and uh, our method at the Nottingham Form 2018, and it proposes an easy and straightforward application for all the structure type, independently of the, the combination of the structural elements. So we have finally proposed the application of the formula to rubble mound breakwaters and vertical walls with parapet, obtaining a similar accuracy. So further laboratory tests are programmed at the University of, U of Bologna uh, to, to deliver such formula extended to these latest kind of structures. Thank you for your attention.